everybody, it's a quick gear video for you. Just wanted to show you my uh, kitchen bucket, my five gallon kitchen bucket. I already have it opened up here. It's my gamma seal bucket, and I've already taken out the folding sink and the folding bucket. This bucket's made mainly for car camping and canoe camping, you know, so there's obviously a little more in it than you'd take if you were just backpacking. But you know, it's nice to have things like the sink in the bucket. And this uh, kit is made for, you know, four people. So there's four cups in it. Something that's not kitchen gear, but very nice to have. Clothesline and clothespins. If you, uh, you know, you're washing your dish towels, dish rags, or washing anything really, it's, it's really nice to have. So I always leave it in there. Always glad to have it after two or three days of camping. Oh, what else is in here? Bowls. Bowls for four people. Tablecloth. Tablecloth isn't really necessary, but it is nice when you have all these, uh, you go to these campgrounds and the picnic table is covered in bird crap or who knows what. It just makes things so much nicer if you have a tablecloth and some, and some clips to hold it in place from blowing away. I always squeeze a couple of these in the bucket. Roll up cutting mats. Those are always a nice option to have. You never think about that until you're prepping supper on the picnic table with the bird poop on it. So the things like the tablecloth and the cutting cutting boards really really come in handy. So then there's things like tongs and spatulas and spoons, all that sort of thing. Pretty standard. I have some tenacious tape in there. That's good for anything, really, your tent or anything, but it's I keep it in this kit mainly for my sink and bucket. Wash pad. Lid from a pot that's in there, actually. I did manage to get a pot in there. Cutlery set for four people. And there's the pot. It had the cutlery set in it as well as washcloths, scrub pads, dish soap, can opener if you, you know, I don't really don't take cans camping that much though. Bottle opener, that's, whew, that's a pretty important thing to have. If you camp with me, it is anyway. So that's the pot. Also in here, just an assortment of knives, some steak knives that are a little nicer than the ones in, in that kit, a little sturdier, serrated knife. Or, you know, whatever, your bagels, tomatoes, whatever. And also a couple of bigger knives that come in a case, which is nice, so you don't, you know, cut yourself to pieces on them. And what else? Plates, actually. I have eight in here. You can go with four, but eight's nice, you know, depending what you're having. Sometimes some meals, you know, you need a plate for buns and a plate for this and a plate for that. So really the only thing I don't have in here that I want to put in here is a bowl of some kind, like a salad bowl or a mixing bowl. I might try to fit my small coffee pot in here as well, but you know, that's that's pretty much it. That's the bucket. There's still a little bit of room in there if I really work at it. But like I said, I didn't have the Dutch oven or a frying pan in it. Obviously, they're way too big. I'm not even going to try. And I don't like a folding frying pan for, you know, four people. You want to have a big frying pan for bacon and eggs, or at least I do. Anyway, that's the video. That's the bucket. Let me know in the comments what I forgot to put in or what you would suggest that I bring along, because uh, I'm sure there's something. Thanks for watching.